Welcome to another episode of Skunk Work. I'm your host, Jay. Now, this is our Master Can Training version 9.1, lesson 4. Or it could be 5. I'm losing track. You guys are not helping out. Nobody is writing in the description. Come on, what's going on? Alright, so nobody's subscribing. Nobody is writing in the comment sections. I see that a lot of you guys are watching the videos but not subscribing. Freeloaders. And you guys are not participating. So what's the problem? Tell me, what's your problem? Why are you not participating? You're just watching and you're not subscribing. All right, so... Let's get this out of the way here. Call to action. Call to action. One more time. Call to action. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that bell notification so you know when you'll see my next video. New videos come out every Saturday at 3 o'clock Pacific Standard Time. All right, you guys you should know this by now. All right, so... Those that are not subscribing, well, what can I do? I've been giving you guys videos, so let's get to it. All right, today's episode, let's start here. Let's hit our F9. All right, so now let's create, create a point. Position X is going to be zero, comma, nine point eight three five five six. Look at these numbers down here. All right, let's see. There it is, right there. Okay, so now. Let's create some lines here. Remember, every episode is different. It's not like one of those other guys. They do everything the same. All right. Let's create a line. Polar. you never seen polar before. At a point. So right, right here. There. And we're going to hit... Two, nine, two, point five. And we're going to go about 12 inches. There we go. Then we're going to hit this point again. And we're going to go 270 minus 22.5. Now, if you don't know where I'm getting these angles and degrees from, put it in the comments. 12 inches. There we go. Look at that. Now, we're going to create a line. So, we're going to create a line horizontal at the origin and end point. There we go. Now, let's join those two. Modify. Join. That one and that one. There we go. Now, let's, uh, let's modify. Let's trim these things here. These lines. Now, I know you see me trim it with one entity, two entity. What's next? Well, let's find out. Uh, modify, trim. We did one. We did two. Now, let's do three. So, it's simple. Just touch where you want to keep. I want to keep this one, this one, and this one. Look. Whoa. Isn't that amazing? You just learned how to trim three. All right. So, now, let's create an art. Let's get this right here. So, let's create an art point diameter, and that's going to be half inch. Point five, and we're gonna put that right here, right on the point. 
All right, so now let's create some of the vertical lines. So create a line vertical from the point right there all the way down. Okay, now let's uh, offset. X4, offset. We're going to copy. And we're going to uh, offset this thing 8.14804. We're going to divide that by 2 minus 1 inch. Whoa, look at all that. You need a calculator? No. And we're going to offset that line. There we go. Now, we're going to create something new here for you guys. So, to create something new, we're going to do this. Create next menu. Chamfer. you never done chamfer before. So, we're going to do distance, one distance. Distance one here is 250. And, of course, it's a 45-degree angle. And... We're going to hit OK. Now, we're going to touch what we want chamfer there and there, there and there. I hope you saw that. Right there, you see that? Okay, now we're going to uh, X4 and offset. X4 and offset. Copy one inch. We're gonna hit OK. Hit there, up, there. Now we're going to offset again. We're gonna offset it. So we're already offset. So when I touch this. Oh, we went too far. We didn't tell it. We don't want to do the same thing. So I'm going to hit our back button. And we're going to say offset. Instead of doing one inch, we're going to offset it 750. Enter. Now hit OK. There. Now, we're going to... Offset again, so we're gonna hit back button here and hit offset Now we're going to Offset this by typing in 6.14804 Divide that by 2 minus 0.500 See do you need a calculator hit ok enter now I hit OK. I'm going to touch this center one, move it over. Touch this one, move it over. Do we need a calculator? I don't think so. So let's uh, do some fillets. So we're going to uh, modify fillet radius. And we're going to do 250.250. And we're going to do, do this right about here. Touch what you want to trim. There. Now, we're going to um, put in some, some points here. All right. So, let's create a point position. And when I put it right here, so our X is going to be 0. Our Y is going to be 375, 3 eighths. Okay. Now, we could put some holes in here. Create an arc. Point diameter. Yeah. Now, we're going to... 
put these holes here and these holes are going to be 250. No, they're going to be a half inch, 0.5. And we're going to hit right there intersection. Right there intersection. And we're going to hit our back button. And we're going to hit point diameter. And 716. So what is 716? That's a fraction. How do you convert that to decimal? Come on, write in the comments before I do it. 716 is 0.4, 437.5. And, and you probably think, well, I had a calculator. No, you just, the more you do these, you memorize them. It's that simple. All right, so now we got a whole bunch of lines here. So let's, uh, let's trim this stuff right here. So let's see. We need to do this again. Modify, trim, three entities. So let's touch where we want to keep. One, two, three. Well, there it goes. But like we said, if we don't make any mistakes, we don't learn. See, we lost this line here. And now I did this on purpose just to show you guys. So we just hit our undo. Now we go back. Back up. And we need to do one entity. Touch this to that. This to that. You see how simple we fixed that? All right, so now Let's get rid of these lines here. So let's now do delete this line, that line, this line. All right, let's uh, hit fit the screen. Now, let's get rid of this red line here. So when they go here, screen, clear colors. There we go. Now, let's delete this line here. Cause we don't need this anymore. Okay, now we got to work here. So we can't see it. So we're going to hit our screen zoom. Click there and there we go. See, now we can see it. See, we get it even bigger. So now we're going to have to trim. So let's try three entities again. See if it works. Create, no, modify, trim. Three entities. So I uh, touched this one, this one, and this one. Boom! Look at that. All right. So there's our radius. See that? Good focus. Now when I hit uh, fit the screen, and now we're gonna do this. Delete all points. Now look at the screen right here and there. On. I'm going to hit our F9. And there we go. Now, I hope you enjoy that one. It was a little longer and tricky. You can see here we have a little radius on the top. Chamfer is here. We have a little miniature cutout here. Three holes. And like always, I tell you, this is a real job. I'm not going to do dimensions. So let's see what the part looks like. And there we go. Of course, there's more than one. But you just see right there what it looks like. All right. And there in the center... Or right there, there's the ring. See that? All right, so there you go. Be sure to hit that subscribe button. I know you learned something. All my videos are never the same. You see different function keys right here. So come on, you guys. Hit that subscribe, call to action, subscribe. Hit that subscribe button. 
How hard does it is it? And ring that bell. Okay. And again, you like watching me do the stuff and you don't have the software up here. Well, I told you, if you help me, I help you. I have to get you the software. But you have to ask. A lot of you guys are wasting opportunity. You know, I'm not going to make this offer any longer. You're not, nobody's asking for the software. There's the software. So, call to action. Hit that subscribe button. Ring that bell for notification. Every Saturday at 3 o'clock Pacific Standard Time. New video. And you'll see this video here. And these are real jobs. You know, that's real. And there it is. I didn't tell you who the customer was for this job. It was Boeing. All right, then. So I hope you uh, subscribe. Say hello. Tell me where you're from. I'll give you a shout out. That means I'll tell you, hey, so-and-so said hello to the channel. So, here we go again. This is Skunk Work. Hope you enjoy Master Cam learning. All right. Good night.